Economy, Society and Public Policy, or ESPP for short, is the core project's course material for all non-economic specialist learners, whether in full-time education or not, who are interested in better understanding the world. It's especially useful for students who are taking other majors and who want to take an optional economics course with an emphasis on policy. It's also being used as a text for courses in PPE and public policy. You can find ESPP by selecting it on the front page of the core website or go directly to it at core-econ.org slash ESPP. Like all cores material, online it's free and open access. If you're teaching, the material in ESPP is supplied under a Creative Commons license as well, so you can use all of it or just selected parts of it and combine them with your existing course. There are 12 units in ESPP. If you have seen Cause The Economy, our material for economics majors, the topics and treatments may seem familiar, but we've simplified some of the mathematics and models and placed a greater emphasis on policy challenges and choices. Unlike The Economy, ESPP is designed to require only the most basic math skills. In ESPP, we have followed Core's principle of motivating the material and explaining economic models using empirical data and real-life experience, which teachers tell us is the best way to interest and excite students. We've also made the units as interactive as possible, so when you see a footnote or a definition, for example, it's available as a pop-up. Economist in Action videos give well-known economists the opportunity to explain the work they do. Students who use our material say they learn fastest when we add interactive tests to the text, and so there are multiple choice questions throughout, with explanations of the answers. Many of our figures are interactive as well. This is especially important for first-time students who can use them to learn how an economic model works, or to understand where an equilibrium comes from, or how we make choices. For the first time, in partnership with the website Our World in Data, students can now click on a button underneath some of the figures to investigate a fully interactive version. Many teachers use ESPP to support classes that teach quantitative methods, and we want all ESPP students and teachers to get their hands dirty with real world data. So whenever the figures use publicly available datasets, you can download them by clicking on the source. One way we encourage students to do economics and not just learn about it is by setting data handling exercises with step-by-step -step instructions. This means they not only learn economic principles, but they can pick up skills that we hope they can use in other courses or in the workplace. Of course, some students will have more advanced maths, so we've included some Find Out More sections, which curious students can click on to explore the topics in more detail. ESPP is also closely linked to Core's standalone ebook Doing Economics. Doing Economics offers a full set of empirical projects which students can complete either in Excel or using R. They use real data from real sources. This helps to explain the models, concepts, and policy options in ESPP. If you prefer a paper-based version of our text, there is now a low-cost version of ESPP that is published by Oxford University Press. And you can also use it as a free app. Even if you don't have Wi-Fi or a signal, it means you can have access to all the material. We hope you enjoy using ESPP. You can find out more about what we have done and what we provide by reading our blogs or just dive in and have a look at it. Let us know how you get on. We listen to all of your feedback and it helps us to keep improving ESPP and its support materials.